I'm Carl with a quick look at the latest showbiz news. Coming up, The Hobbit has its world premiere in New Zealand, and Thai male prisoners dance Gangnam style for first. X Factor judge Louis Walsh has received an apology and over £400,000 in a settlement with newsgroup newspapers. It's after the Irish Sun ran a story which falsely claimed he'd sexually assaulted a man. This had a terrible effect on me, guys, because it was all lies. But I remain very angry at the treatment I received at the hands of the Sun. And the story did start with the Irish Sun. Up to 100,000 fans are thought to have turned out for the world premiere of The Hobbit in Wellington, New Zealand. Many got a glimpse of the cast members, including Martin Freeman, Elijah Wood and Kate Blanchett. Films the first in a trilogy. The Twilight Saga has made it a second week at the top of the UK box office. It brought in more than £5 million in cinemas across the UK and Ireland at the weekend. Sky falls in second place with takings of nearly £4 million. Sharp Tony's Jason Gardner is to return to the judging panel on the next series of Dancing on Ice. It comes just a year after he was replaced by Louis Spence. Louis says he's been kicked to the curb. There's no escaping Gangnam style. Inmates at a male prison in Thailand took part in a competition to see who could do the best horsey dance. Even the guard gave it a go. Check that out. Officials there reckon the competition helped relax the convicts who include drug smugglers and robbers. And that's more than enough showbiz from me for now. For the very latest, head over to our website. That's at bbc.co.uk slash entertainment news.